This is Himadri from Take and Take and today I am going to show you how to prepare the traditional Chinese hot pot in a subcontinental way. As it is a subcontinental style, style hot pot so it will be a bit spicy but you will get the flavor of the traditional Chinese hot pot and I hope that you will like this recipe and the uh, and it's very delicious and also it's very nutritious for your health. So I'm going to show you what are the things that are going to be needed for this recipe. You can see that this is cauliflower. I have uh, made the small pieces of this cauliflower and here is the pumpkin. And uh, this is uh, mushroom and we'll also uh, add some uh, black pepper. You can see here is some uh, black pepper and uh, this is ginger and uh, this is green chili though this is red chili uh, and it's spicy also and uh, uh, you can see here are small pieces of chicken without bone and uh, in subcontinent we call this as chicken kima and uh, uh, this is a small prawn and uh, you need to boil it and uh, this is tasty salt and uh, this is normal salt and uh, this is a, a spicy mixture uh, how uh, this is made I'm going to tell you uh, this is made up with uh, the uh, chili green chili and with the chili sauce and here you see this is the rice in a traditional way we prepare this but mix some chili sauce and also some black pepper so it will add some extra flavor and you can add also some salt as per your need and uh, this is the curry we are going to mix it with the hot pot so this is the curry and uh, here is you can see this is cabbage and uh, this is broccoli and you can also see uh, this is the noodles here and uh, you can also add two eggs one or two eggs with these noodles and uh, this egg can be from broiler chicken or your uh, deshi uh, chicken and uh, here you see this is the water that we are uh, going to use for this and uh, uh, this is the pot in which we are going to boil all these things and uh, later we will show you the process how to boil this one by one now you can see that we are boiling everything uh, with this water and we are using induction heater and you see this is the egg and the mushroom, broccoli, pumpkin, cabbage, everything those are boiling uh, below this there are sh uh, shrimp and also uh, the pieces of chicken and uh, you do not need to boil this rice because you are going to eat this rice with this mixture and uh, also you can add these noodles right now or you can also add it to the ladder when you want uh, so it's boiling now now we do need to give some time to boil this and uh, the mixture is just getting better and better as the time goes it will become better and better you can see that we have spent around 10 to 15 minutes and the uh, vegetables noodles and everything is almost boiled and now we will start serving this hot pot into bowl. You can see that this is the served hot pot and while this is getting boiled you can take more vegetables and other elements from this bowl and you can eat this at the same time. You can eat it with rice and mix some curry with it and I can bet you this is very nutritious, delicious also. You can try it anytime at your home if you have these vegetables and elements and I think that you eat all these vegetables every day. Just you need to boil this and make this mixture and you will get the delicious food. Thank you.